power says this next disturbance uh, pinwheels and rotates its way through behind this cold front. It's also going to bring a shot of some windier and gusty conditions as well as some of those colder temperatures as we go into your Monday. So this evening we'll see as isolated showers begin to start to increasing in coverage after about eight and nine o'clock. It's going to see we're going to see those temperatures fall into the 40s. It's going to be a cold and blustery start to your Monday. Bring the rain jackets to the bus stop and plenty of cloud cover and plenty of cold temperatures as well. We're only going to see those temperatures in the upper 40s by your lunchtime, and those rain showers will become a bit more isolated into the afternoon tomorrow. A lot of clouds will be around. A few peaks of sunshine are going to try to make their way through, but it's going to be a breezy and cold afternoon as temperatures struggle to get to the low 50s. And we're not done with those colder temperatures. As we go through your overnight into Tuesday, yeah, we're going to see those temperatures falling into the upper 30s to get out the door on your Tuesday. And those temperatures don't really recover much with the few spotty showers around for your Tuesday afternoon. Highs not even making it to 50. So tonight, 43 degrees, mostly cloudy and breezy. Scattered showers will be developing and increasing in coverage through the, through the night. A blustery cold, 53 degrees tomorrow. Windy showers, especially in the morning, just a chance of an afternoon shower. So the chilly, the windy, and the rain showers, big on the hassle factors. We stay cool through Wednesday, and then better weather for the second half of the weekend. Take a look at next weekend. Looking great with a lot of sunshine and temperatures getting back closer to 70 degrees.